Okay, now we're going to talk about 5.1 number 7. This is a problem that uh, gives a lot of students difficulty. And what they want you to do is find the coordinates of the points in the figure. And right off the bat, when I look at this, I got, I got to say, okay, they gave me the points right in here. They gave me points B as negative H and 2K. So that's, uh, that's where I'm going to do a lot of. Negative H is the X value. 2K is the Y value. So that's going to allow me to find the X value for point D right down here because the X value for point D is going to be the same. It'll be negative H. So that's negative H. And then above, uh, the X value for point A is also going to be negative H. Now we could tell this is true because you can also see that point C here has an X value of negative 2H and that means that these must be equidistant and these must be equidistant. The Y value, if the Y value for point B is 2K, then the Y value for point A is going to have to be twice that, or 4K. And then again, what's the Y value going to be for point C? It's going to be the same. It's going to be the same. It's going to be 4K. So that's the logic that you go through on these kinds of problems.